Well, good morning. This is David, your friendly neighborhood crappie wrangler. And so now I've said a few times that these crappie will hit anything. I think one time I said they'd hit a piece of shoestring if you put it on your hook. Well, I didn't have a piece of shoestring I didn't need, but I cut a piece off the end of my marker buoy rope. And I've got it gluing up now, and here in a little bit, now I'm going to pick it up and try to catch a crappie on it. Just to prove that it could be done. It'll be crappie on it. Okay, I got that fish in the olive oil. Uh, here's my piece of shoelace. I'm going to see if I can catch a fish on a piece of shoelace. I've got it on a 16th ounce jig. And let's see. It's still on the way down there. There we go. Got her down there amongst fish and there's one looking at it. God, he bumped it and I missed. Oh, and I got him that time. Look at that. <clears throat> There's a crappie on a shoelace. So, the point is, you don't need a bunch of real high dollar lures to catch crappie. There's the one I pulled out of them. Shoelace. Female, I scraped her up coming up. Let me throw her in the box. Now, I guess when a day comes, if I ever have a day come that I have sponsors, this is going to hurt me because I just proved you can catch a crappie on a shoelace. And uh, for all the guys that spend a fortune on on crappie lures you don't have to this time of year these fish aren't that uh, picky the important thing is getting the jig right in front of the fish's face not having a certain jig or anything else You just have to get it in their face and, and they'll hit it. 